Flex. Top 10 Slitherio player here. Oh wait, I forgot. I I am Ratman47. To everyone. It's a good name. It's a good name. I downloaded League the other day. Same name. I keep a buck fifty. I am Ratman forty seven to I forgot how much anxiety this so much anxiety. to be just a regular old I feel like everyone else is so much more aggressive than I am all the time also I didn't scroll through all of the skins I don't know if the pretty ones from last time are available or not but there's some really welcome welcome brown hope your new year is starting off probably have to go so it's been wonderful i'm just trying to live a pacifist life as usual i hope that nothing nothing can make me aggressive I just hope to float through life, as always, with a gigantic heart. I feel like if I played Agario, I would just like give all the- Smaller, even larger players. Because that's an option, but it's not an option in this one, which is cool. You thought you could sneak past me with a stream? What? Welcome, welcome! Can I ask why you're playing this if you're back? It's gonna be a super short stream because I have a test. So I put this on the schedule. Um, because it's something... Like, games during the week aren't usually AAA unless I know I'm free. Because... Schoolwork can be really demanding. Sometimes. Stuff during the week is usually things that I can stop immediately. Lucky, welcome, welcome. I hope your year is starting off as a W. Welcome, welcome. I am honored. The great Lucky has visited. The day is my day. I feel like I'm yelling so loud, but that's the only way my mic can hear me. Way, the only way. Oh goodness. Thought you could just run your subway sandwich into my subway sandwich, huh? Yeah, I have to talk super loud to be picked up by my mic. It's really, really tough. Hopefully that's a little better. I moved it closer. And I'm talking louder! I can't stay for so long here to stop by. Imagine streaming to ignore DMs. It's on my schedule, dude. I would never ignore anyone unless they deserved it, and honestly, you're not in that category right now. 
That's not to say it can't happen, but it's not how it is right now. So, uh, Pach, you ignore me a lot, and you're a quiet bean. Oh, is it? Is the stream really quiet? I feel like I am yelling really loud right now. I feel like I'm about to be evicted. Asked a question, got a threat in response. Well, you know, it really... It really depends on, like, how I'm feeling that day, you know? It's not quiet? Okay, good. Just like I thought I had to, like, 100% boost everything. I will try my best to get in that category. Why do you want that? Don't want that. Don't want that, hey. You're just naturally quiet? What? Oh, you mean like my voice type? Yeah, definitely. I'm not- I'm not the yelling kind. Catch you later, frown. Gummy worm game? Vunny, welcome, welcome. Hope your new year is starting off 100%. I am indeed the gummiest worm out there. How's your day been, Vunny? And Lockie, how's your day been? On this beautiful, beautiful uh, end of the week time. Hope you all have great things planned for your weekends. I'm just casually getting stalked by that little snake back there. That little gummy worm. Oh my goodness. Because if I get in that category, I can win every argument by saying something, then you'll ignore me. Uh... I mean, I don't really argue a lot. And then if we're if we're arguing about if someone's cute, then you know I can't back down from that. It's a part of my character. It's um, it's written in my programming that I have to convince everyone that they're cute if they don't think so. I can't back down from that. But I mean, if you insult me or something, I'll probably just ignore. <laughs> but it's 9 a.m. I've been trying to increase my drawing skills more and more each day. Let's go. Yeah, I saw what you posted in the Discord. Love that. Even though you can't divulge who it's for. It looked like it might be for an emote or something, but... That's just my speculation that you don't need. What drawing program do you use, Funny? I will change your programming? Impossible. Also, I'm going to die. I will die. Oh my gosh, this snake is so long. Okay, finally. Oh man, for a second I thought that was the end. Y'all see that orange snake absolutely trying to end my whole Christmas? Well, not today, Orange Grinch, not today. I'll change your programming, Lockie. But I just open up your console and type in Alt F4, how about that? Does that say Rahi? Dude, I love Rahi. Probably not the Rahi I know, but very nostalgic. You have a great day, Rahi. Rahi's a friend of the street. Just hug me, really? Is it you? Rahi, welcome. You look like a little alien with that, like. I don't know what that is, like little antenna. Rehi, we will rule, like the number one in two spots. Here, take of my flesh so that you might become more strong. No, don't leave me. No. Yeah, that was supposed to be me, Rehi. How could you? How could you do this? I appreciate your offering. Next time, allow me to do the same. Allow me to do the same. You underestimate my coding power one sec. For right now, I use Ibis Paint on my drawing tablet. I've never tried Ibis Paint, but it sounds amazing. Have you tried using... I currently use Paint Tool, Paint Tool Sci. Have you tried using Paint Tool Sci before? Or Clip Studio? And Lockie sent me a DM. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Let me... Let me read this DM aloud to the class, as there are no passing passing notes during class here. No living, I'm kidding, I mean no dashing. 
Okay, I won't dash. What? I don't understand, Lockie. It sounds kind of like a threat, but... I don't know what you're talking about. I've lived my life honestly up until this point. Imagine if like after I said up until this point, I like showed all of my fraudulent mattress businesses and my money laundering to you all. It hasn't gotten that bad yet. But there's a chance. You all don't know what I'm capable of. Let me get my stretches in here. Oh man, thank you so much for the tune-up. I feel like a brand new Pac. Pac 2, you might say, or Tupac. You wanna read the DM on stream? Be my guest, you ruin the wholesomeness? Oh no, I, I wasn't actually gonna read it out loud. I, I feel like that'd be a bad idea. Something in my soul tells me this. The music stopped. Aren't you the Mafia boss? Would you like to be my Dawn Vice President, Vunny? I think you can do it with those memes. Oh man, I promise you. He'll be swimming in your memes, my guy. Honestly, I think my grandma might have a couple ties to the Mafia. She was like just casually told a story during Christmas about how she met a hitman and she's like yeah he told me if I ever needed someone gone then that's his whole job to think like people like that of course they exist out there but that like man you're that close you could just be walking by someone and they're like oh you're my target and that's the end Gotta be someone's grandpa. Yeah, that hitman's definitely someone's grandpa now. I'm gonna gotta go have fun. Could have made that DM worse. Oh, I get it now. Oh wait, Lockie, please. You should really respect your elders. I read it again. After you said that it wouldn't be wholesome. Okay. I'm watching you. How dare you? I see what you mean now that it wasn't the most wholesome thing. Have a wonderful rest of your day. And thanks for stopping by. When you say the hitman's probably someone's grandpa. It reminds me of that hitman. I'm not sure if it was an anime where like this dude hasn't like actually been a hitman for years but like he's still one of the best in the game that was definitely an anime and it's like a retired like now overweight dude i need to watch that anime i just didn't have a chance to oh my gosh it's rehi again i'm rehi we will take over this whole land It shall be you and I at the top. No question. Oh, you're making hearts. That's awesome. Let us rule over this domain, Rehi. And then, like, we're both swallowed by a giant snake. By the way, if anyone, like, wants to jump in and play Slither... Hey, I didn't even know we'd be in the same server. I thought there were, like, tons of servers out there, but... I guess it's just the one. And there are 400 of us playing. I wonder if that's 400 worldwide or just 400 like locally. Because I consider, I consider Slither a dying game if like there's only 400 of us in total. Bad face. Chrome extension allows you to connect directly to individual servers. A list of all the server and their top scores. Oh no. What if there's someone out there whose goal is to like get the top score on every server? 
but the servers are in alphabetical order so they spell out something. Like, Rehi is super amazing. I feel like that's possible. I would do that. I would spell out Rehi is super amazing. And by the way, how has your year been, Rehi? I hope it's been super nice. New year, new us. Did you know doctors wish you were sick, mechanics wish you have car problems, but only a thief wishes you prosperity? Whoa there. Now you're gonna say that bakers wish you were hungry. Or that teachers wish you were dumb. Anything but that. Don't do it to me. Don't do it. What? Starting off with bacterial infection on amoxicillin? Oh man, yeah, that's... that's painful. Do you have to follow up with Diflucan or anything? I hate when that happens. But you will make a full recovery because you are very, very strong. I'm sure that you lift cars. they up easily, caught it early. Got you, got you, got you. Oh man, someone ate me? What was their name, Rahi? I'll find them. It is my goal in life to find this terrible, terrible culprit. How could they do this to you? Point them out. Being too chatty, need to focus. This is a snake eat snake world. No, we're, we're just relaxing here. Just relaxing, maxing. We should be spending our evenings and afternoons and mornings and pre-noons vibin'. Got COVID and nearly died, but now I'm fine. Funny. Oh my gosh. When was that? And congratulations on your recovery, dude. It must have been like super scary at the time. It's a snake consumed snake world. Yeah, it's a Ouroboros world. Where are my homies? Where are my homies with the Ouroboros? Y'all know the snake eating itself? I feel like that sometimes. Especially when I've had too much for dinner and then I have dessert and I'm like, man. I, I'm super stuffed. <laughs> Tiffany, welcome, welcome. Oh my gosh. You guys, he for me, big friend. Big friend of the stream. I'm about to trap this one, but big friend of the stream. Hifu, I hope your year is going amazing. Super duper amazing. Thanks for the follow. I believe I'm also following you. I I make sure to or I think I did to follow everyone in Higambana. So grateful to have you guys. How lucky, lucky I am. So, as a bit of context, Ifuni is super cool. We're part of Higambana, which uh, has a bunch of YouTubers and artists and singers and instrumental makers and beat makers and just all around really cool people. And I don't even know how I found them or how they found me. A lot, a lot of luck went into that one. But yeah, if y'all see anyone from Higambana, like Ifu or Mie or Saku or Sarah or Laz, who we big, also a big friend, we visit sometimes. Def, check them out. There's my murder of the religious snake. Is that is that this right here? I feel like it's this one. Wait, no, it's not. No, it's not. Oh no, I need to find the religious snake again. Where's the cross snake? He purple? Okay, good, 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 good. Keep giving me these identifiers. I am going to get him. I wish the map showed colors, because I would totally, like, follow that purple snake until the end of time. Show him just how strong you've become, Rehi. Yeah, we should gang up on him together. 
I feel like that kind of strategy should work. But for now, I have to stock the purple... The purple... Pope. The purple Pope. I'm stocking the purple Pope. I'm gonna poke the purple Pope. Hopefully my mic isn't popping too much. I'm gonna poke the purple Pope for Rehi. Vengeance. Like Tron, use the force. Yeah, exactly. In the hit film Tron, they use the force. I loved Baby Yoda's part in that. Oh. Oh my gosh, that's a big one. Where is the purple Pope? And then, like, he quit game. Big sad. This game is basically Squiggly Tron. It do be, honestly. Or Squiggly Agario, I feel like. I feel like it's easier also to understand that other, like, paper game, like Paper I.O., like, that game... That game takes too much brain power, dude. No thanks. And then with the Gario, I'd give away all my pieces just because I can. Oh, I don't know if you guys can see the leaderboard, which is probably good, because sometimes people have weird stuff up there. But I think 1 through 10, maybe my eyes don't work, which might also be possible. I think there's a group, 1 through 10, who's trying to have, like, all blink. Like, that's really cool. They're probably gonna take out, like, the spots that aren't blink until there's just nothing. Return to nothing. Return to the beginning. That's what we'll do. Return to creation. Let's see, I'll go towards the center. Wait, nope. 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 Going too fast. Deep IO is funner? I've never heard of Deep IO. But I will definitely try it and see what's up. If you like Vani, then it must be amazing. Deep IO. Are you... Rehi? Are you red.io? If there's anything odd on that website I just said, I don't condone it by the way. I've, I've never been to red.io. <laughs> I hope that it's an okay website. Y'all, this is actually the first time I've ever changed my skin, and honestly, I'm feeling a lot more attached than I have to a snake ever in my life. I ended my name with Eo before they existed, copyright? You need to track them down and absolutely bring them to justice. I wonder why everyone left. And there's just a big pile of free guts there. All these guts just for me. BPO is perfectly fine. Oh, I was talking about Regio. <laughs> Red.io. I didn't- I've never been there before. Maybe I should stop saying it just in case. Anyway, this is the center, so it's pretty dangerous, but I don't see I don't see our purple fiend yet. And I'm definitely on the hunt. Definitely on the hunt. I think I'll try if maybe they like to hang out on the right side. The right side plus this dude just keeps keeps following me. Leave me alone. I just want to be alone with my thoughts. My thoughts of pacifism. Oh, someone told me the other day that like the Xbox One is gonna go out of style and it's only Xbox X. Like, only Monica, except only Xbox X, Series X. 
Like they're just gonna stop making games for Xbox One. Head empty, only snick. Head whoosh, only hiss. <laughs> only hissing. Hopefully my DSer is working and that wasn't awful. Head empty. Only cold blooded egg laying, heat seeking, scaly, kissing, pork tongue snack, venomous, most venomous around. I'm hoping they don't do that like they did the 360. Funny, it is wild. Like, I was super excited to play Dark Souls. Like, your boy, it has Dark Souls. I have like one and two, but for 360, so. You're not compatible with Xbox One. So I feel that pain right in my soul. And I have to figure out another way to play Dark Souls. I've never played Dark Souls before. They're taking away my whole life here. Pain. But, other than that, I'll have to find some way to get a Series X. Maybe I can, like, offer my firstborn son or something. Y'all, there's so many consoles out there, it's crazy. Don't know why they don't have backwards compatibility, Nintendo has it on certain games. Exactly. Man. I don't know too much about Nintendo, but I feel like they'd probably be more together, especially since their market is more handhelds, like um, like the DS and stuff. Like those are definitely down packed, super backwards compatible, because people can play them on the subway, or I don't know, as they're walking along the side of a river, really aesthetically. But not here. Not here, pain. We need to optimize things for the subway, that's all I'm saying. I haven't had a proper handheld in such a long time. I don't know what handhelds y'all grew up with, but I remember having like a PSP, like a Nintendo DS, DSi. Maybe a Game Boy? No, my first one was a DS. I guess Xbox has never really had a handheld. Isn't that weird? Did they like work on that? People love handhelds. Oh, I'm rank 20. Wowza. I think that says 20. I'll move this up a little bit so y'all can see my score here. There we go. I just have to flex a little bit. Y'all know me, I have a problem. I wonder what the Xbox handheld would be like. You have an X box that goes on the floor, I guess. Maybe you could have like an X block. Box, call me. This is an idea right here. Uh, dread it, run from it. The snake arrives all the same. True. No one can escape the snake. The snake comes for all equally. It does not discriminate. It attacks. With speed. What are what are some of your favorite games, Bunny? I like Okami. I need to play Okami sometime again. Just remember how great it was. 
because it has been a real long time. I wonder why this area looks like the center. Getting a little crazy out here in these streets, you know what I'm saying? I'm on the periphery too. Alright, this one's out for blood. I better leave. It looks too much like me and I don't like that. I just had to... Scare it away, you know? Scare it away. It's about to see an opportunity. I better leave. There are so many, I don't really think I have a favorite. I feel that. Oh my gosh. Like, World of Warcraft was also very nice back in the day. <gasps> oh no! I thought I had a better turn radius than that. Ratman47 back at it again. Need to upgrade my turn radius, I guess. Need to upgrade my snake wheels. I wonder what turn radius snakes have in real life. I know cats are liquid, so they have like a really infinite turn radius. Maybe snakes are the same. Maybe they are the same. Alright, that one was going so fast. It was actually really scary. I can't stand things that go so fast. As they're just slimes with fur, honestly. And on Twitter, it's been nice seeing like people raiding like cat loaves. I don't know if y'all have seen that, but like, I guess I should take a sip of water. I'm dying. That is what a day of class will do to you, but yeah, on Twitter, there's like people raiding a bunch of loaves of cats. And they're like, hmm, no tail. Hmm, I can't see a single paw. This is a high quality cat loaf you have here. Oh goodness. It was like, I thought that red one was going to come for me. quality cat loaves i want a cat loaf one day oh one of my favorite ones that i guess is just kind of big and i happen to see it but like there was a dude who had a cat loaf in his hand and he was like hey can you can you hold this for me i'll be right back is a cat loaf cat loaves are so adorbs hifu i need to get I need to get a whole cat to make a cat loaf. It's just not the same with a dog. Not the same. Is there any dog that can make a dog loaf? Hmm. You know, it a corgi might be able to do it, but I feel like the yeah, the energy's different. The energy's definitely different. What else? What else? Like the big woolly dogs? Like that's a sheep. Not even a loaf anymore. <laughs> you have to like rename it from like cat loaf to or cats to maybe like, I don't know. Oh, what shape would dogs make? I'm really struggling with this. Dogs would make a... a Maybe like a baguette? 
I'm too quick, I can't be caught. Especially not when I'm thinking about cat loaves. My power level is through the roof when I think about cat loaves. Oh, it's over for me. This giant dude. Hopefully he just passes by like a storm. Very pretty coloring we have here. Nice. That's a big candy cane. Real talk. Peppermint is low tier. I can't believe that missed me. I'm pretty sure that guy's also wondering how it missed me. But I don't know why. I've never really liked peppermint. Like, I like the candy canes that are like a bunch of different flavors in one. Or it just tastes like sugar like when I was younger, but... I feel like spearmint is top tier, like winter green, like those little mints. I don't like peppermint anything, same. You know, spiders also don't like peppermint. <laughs> Ifu, I don't like to inform people of this. As I've thought about it myself, but I think we might be spiders. Instead of snakes. And I'm super scared of spiders, so I might burn this house down. <laughs> Just kidding, just kidding. Just kidding. It'll be like a this is fine dog. Where all my friends are spiders, so I'm a spider, so what? Set yourself in the house on fire, so I'm a spider, so what? <laughs> I don't know why I didn't finish that anime. Like, it seemed really cute. But... Oh my gosh, I guess I just stopped along the way for some reason. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, too close, too close. Let's change our skin here. We're optimized for performance now with the... What oh, Rehi had? Okay. We will redeem Rehi. The spider isekai one? Yeah. Yeah, I mean... I don't know if you're one of those people who's like, isekai... Man, I haven't seen that for 0.5 seconds. Boy, I really missed it. Haven't seen that in a long time. Which is yesterday. <laughs> Although, I know that there are some good ones out there. 10 isekai per season? Probably even more than that. Which is why it's really exciting that there are some really cool releases coming up. In 21 and 22. Or... They were said they're gonna come out in 22 during 21. Very exciting. If it's good, then I'll watch it. I can't vouch for that because I stopped watching it. I can't think of any recent good isekais aside from like the basic ones. Uh, I'm back. I have my Berber fries and drink, and I'm ready to vibe. What kind of Berber do you have? Is it from McDonald's or is it from Burger King? Or perhaps from Wendigo? Burber sounds so good right now. Hey, Fu, get yourself a beautiful Burber. Get yourself buttered bread, sesame seeds. Get a little bit of that, that sauce on the buns, whatever that is. Get lettuce tomatoes onions bacon if you're into that maybe not a sunny side up egg that can get messy unless you're that kind of guy i don't know get yourself a patty or two just go crazy in the bottom bun and some cheese if you're into that as well thank you so much for the pet i feel like i'm too low let me oh my gosh let me move myself up Oh my gosh, I'm progressing through life too quickly. Something I can only say in a game. <laughs> Sunny side up egg and burger is good. I've never had that before, but something, something that my uh, dad had once is this is gonna be wild. But he had like a soft shell crab. Or something like that with a hamburger patty on 
burger buns. Wild. It was a crab burger. I can't even imagine what that was like. Why'd you stop? I can feel my stomach calling for food now. We shall eat. We shall eat. Hopefully you have food available. Like if you don't, I feel really bad. Or if you only have instant ramen, I feel really bad. Tell me you have a five course meal where you are. Hopefully you have good food there in Hifumi land, in printer land. Do printers eat? You can print yourself out a really nice picture of the burger I was describing. That's that's my, my best olive branch. Never question this, but what is me? Is it human or an animal? Well, that's a very good question. And um, my lore is about a sentence long. I am a movie VTuber. So my, uh, my dad was a blender and my mom was a wild berry. And then I was born. Yes. That is the extent of my lore. <clears throat> That's all I have, really. <laughs> Crab burger sounds interesting. And you do. Good thing we have DoorDash and Printerland. They really do deliver everywhere. I'm just imagining, like... Maybe they can fax it to you. Bro, what if they faxed you a full meal? I forgot what fax is for. I guess they could also email it to you so you can print it out. You're a blenderberry? I'm I'm just a wild berry smoothie. I'm like a mix of the two, as most people are of their parents. Unless one of the parents was lying. But that's a separate story. Faxing food would be next level. Alright, listen. So I had chemistry back in the day, and imagine if there was smell-o-vision. So when you put on like Great British Bake Off or like Gordon Ramsay's Kitchen, like all of that stuff, imagine if you could smell what was being cooked, like what the air smelt like. smell -o vision I want that so bad. Faxing food would be next level. What is even faxing nowadays though? I don't know. I just know that I tried to fax something once. No, I tried to call a fax number and all I heard was beep beep. I'm like, well, looks like I can't tell like the refrigerator running joke because obviously the fax is running. They just ruined the joke for me. But calling a fax machine is an L. I'll admit to that. I just like mixed up the office and fax numbers that's a rookie mistake i'm not a cool printer like yuhifu i'm sure i'm sure you have connections to all of the printers in the area which reminds me my printer is such a diva i wish i wish it were more well behaved man I'd want to print something, and then it'd be, like, offline. And I'm like, okay, well, what if what if I do a test print? Then it's like, okay, I can see you now. Just needed to warm up. And sometimes the test print is just a blank piece of paper. And it's like, but, but... <laughs> Those printers really do be divas, dude. And oh my gosh, that one almost got me. I cry tears of blood. Oh my gosh. They really trapped me like this. Y'all really? Y'all really think you can contain me like this? Impossible. I am a liquid. Liquids don't conform to their containers. They do not conform to their containers. Joke's on you two. I live in a graveyard. Epic lore, I know. Do you like it there? How many zombies do you see on the daily? You know any cool skeletons like Brook? I love Brook. And does that mean you're dead? I mean, that, that's I. I don't even know if I should say that's cool and all. I guess uh. Uh. Wow. 
imagine you've been speaking to someone on Discord for like a month and they're like, actually, I'm a ghost. Well, that's cool. And you like ask if they'd seen the- Oh! <gasps> well, I've never seen someone do that before. Did you guys see on the left side how someone managed to get out of like the snake- Like the snake hold? By like sheer amazingness? I'm actually getting out of here. I just wanted to comment on the scene, but by no means am I equipped to like make it out of there. Whoa, look at all this. Oh my gosh. Cool. <laughs> gosh. It was nice to go head to head with that big dude. I know one skeleton named Dave and he's my mailman. Yes, I'm a ghost bunny. Dude, Dave sounds like an absolute Sigma King. Awesome. Really have to respect male people. You really do. Really difficult job delivering mail. Oh my gosh, imagine if Brooke, like, from One Piece, delivered mail. And for those of you who don't know Brooke's personality, oh my gosh. That was really close. I, like, had to adjust my, my headphone for a sec. If y'all don't know Brooke from One Piece, his personality is bubbly, and he'll, like, break out in song. Imagine, like, your male person delivered your mail, and it was like, You're welcome! Like, something really cute. And he like breaks out into dance as well. That'd probably be like a lot of effort for every house, but being a skeleton probably doesn't have to worry about muscles getting sore or anything like that. Plus, I bet Brooke would look really cool in the male outfit. Mailman outfit. The male Behold the male outfit. The male outfit, goodness, I don't even know what that is nowadays. There's been so much fashion. What is it called? There's like certain, uh, Mailman the Musical? Yes, Mailman the Musical. If that hasn't been done yet, Vani, that is a, that is a, that is an idea you should keep. No one here will take it. That is a good idea. Like, I feel like Kiki's delivery service tried to do something similar, but they just couldn't match your vision. Imagine. I feel like it could work very, very well. It's actually not too... I guess I should stop before like I actually get caught. I was just about to say that it's not too difficult trying to escape from these holds. I could see what that snake was doing there, but I think that red one... That red one, oh man, that's too bad. Could have been a lot quicker than that. I wish I could, you know, warn him with some kind of hand sign, but I'm kind of limited in that department. Speaking of... Oh, thank you so much for the hydrate. I've, I've said this a couple times, but something interesting about my mom and I is that she doesn't like snakes because she says they don't have enough legs. And that's like literally not their fault, but... That's just the way it is sometimes, and I don't like spiders and centipedes and all that stuff because they have too many legs. We have leg issues as a family. <laughs> yeah. We have really strong leg issues. Man, oh man. And I'm just like, mom, they can't help it. They can't help not having any legs. That's what evolution does to you. 
my friend is the same way with spiders i like them because they have more than two legs whoa whoa does that mean does that mean he like doesn't like dogs that's sacrilegious or four i guess since he has a dog oh okay i was about to say but funny enough like my mom sat next to my dog one time and you know my dog kind of has a long tail kind of has a long tail and she was you know petting my beautiful bouncing boy my son my love of my life my absolute apple of my eye this kind wonderful boy and then like his tail wraps around her, her wrist a little bit and she's like i can't look at your dog the same your dog has a tail like a snake and I was like, what? And, you know, it, it like, dog tails do kind of have a life of their own sometimes, so I, I get that. Snakes are, <laughs> snakes are a vibe, they just be Slytherin. They do be Slytherin. But, but yeah, she can only, like, pet my dog from the front now, never from the back. Man, why'd she have to think about it like that? <laughs> what, uh, what Harry Potter house did you get sorted in? Oh my gosh, I'm about to get trapped. No, no, not today, sir. Oh, goodness, what a prize for your boy. Just have to make sure I don't get caught. Oh wait, oh wait, I'm gigantic. I'm gigantic. Oh, <gasps> I did not mean for that to happen. But I'm glad that it did. I thought someone else would like come and get me, but I guess not. I remember getting put into Hufflepuff back in the days. Hufflepuff? I like that a lot. I... I feel like I was also Hufflepuff. Now I look back and I'm just like, accurate? I feel that. Like, everyone is like, oh, it'd be cool to be Gryffindor or something, unless you're like, die hard, like, Slytherin or Ravenclaw or something like that. But yeah, I feel like throughout my life, I have shown nothing but Hufflepuff behavior. <laughs> and I'm okay with that. <laughs> Oh wow, that was actually really cool over there on the left. Are you just gonna leave though? Okay. Oh, whoopsies. Oh my goodness, okay. I guess I'll take this too. That was really odd. That was a weird exchange. I'm really confused. Oh, maybe... Maybe it's because I'm so large. Everyone's afraid of me. Hufflepuff feels like the forgotten house. No. As long as we are a part of it. There is no way that it can ever be forgotten, not in our hearts. Ifu, we are important as Hufflepuffians. I guess as Hufflepuffs. Hufflepuffians. Hufflepoofs. Gosh, I feel like I feel like trapping something. Puffians. Oh, whoa, that guy was really fast. I mean, but I did get to top 10, so that's really cool. What a strange sequence of events at the end there. Like, why did that guy just, like, leave? Like, like who does that? I feel like it's that meme where that one astronaut's like, I'm gonna get the extra points, and the astronaut behind him is like, are you sure about that? And it just kept going like he was at gunpoint. I thought that was the objective of the game. And he just completely forgot about that. Weird. Can't relate. Pro, pro gaming green snake. Yeah, that was... That was a bit too aggressive. Y'all know I'm a pacifist. Except right then. Except right then. But usually...
Sometimes the smaller snakes think they can get one up on you, but you know what? When you're not in the mood, you just have to whoppa, hey ya, you know, show them who's boss. That snake just ran into you. I guess he knew it was his time to go. And I didn't back down, not that time. That reminds me of when Rehi was here earlier, man. Wait, it's only snakes? Always has been. Wait, we're collecting points around here? Always has been. Just snakes. Which one do y'all think is better, Agario or Slither? Now, I would fail at Agario because I would just give away all of my small bits to, like, other players. Because they look like they need it, you know? Again, why are people just leaving this on the ground? I'm so confused. I feel like it's some kind of trap. What if I've fallen into some kind of trap? It's over for me. I forgot Agario existed? Oh, is it like a... Is it a low tier game now? Bottom tier? LOL. Never heard of it. Forgot about it. Completely out of season. I understand. Now, what's a top tier game... Oh, <laughs> that was so surprising. What's a top tier game to me is Tetra 99. Tetris 99. Everyone moved on from being a circle to being a snake. Understandable. Have a nice day. Yeah, Snake. Snake has more personality. I've never played a Gario before, surprisingly. Well, today is your day to start, bunny. Just kidding. Then Tifu just said the cool kids went on to slither. You know what, bunny? That means never at one point were you not a Super Saiyan cool kid. The party's over at Slither, 100%. This really aggressive snake party. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to attend a really aggressive snake party? Ayo, I was invited to a really aggressive snake party. <laughs> it was great until the last half, but honestly, they really had me in the first half. What if there was single player Slither? You know what? I feel like that could work. Like, single player Slither, where like... This is gonna be weird. It's just an aesthetic... Calming game. Where you just collect all of the orbs. And no one's gonna kill you. No one's going too fast. No one's... You know, aiming for your whole life. It's just you, these orbs, and the wide open road. Yes. I feel like that could work. Look at that dude going so fast. Imagine. It's just like those drivers who like drive really fast on like the interstate or behind you, like basically on your bumper and then you like turn off to Chick-fil-A or McDonald's and you're just like, why did you have to go that fast in the first place? Just vibe and gather orbs? Exactly. That's the kind of world. Me. Pachu. <laughs> this is gonna be so dumb. This is gonna be extremely dumb. Pachu v. Britannia wishes for... <laughs> I hate this already. An aesthetic slither game. Where people can just de-stress and collect orbs without aggression. No ag aggressive snake parties. Yes, that is justice. Single player slither is called snake and it's already a game? No, 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 that's different, that's different. Also, I'm super interested in playing snake right now, but I'll, I'll hold in my urge. I used to really love snake, but... Even then, like, you outgrow your container. 
we must make a bigger container move into a new home if you've outgrown your previous one that is what i am trying to instill yes let there be no stress in this domain only vibe stress empty only vibe i remember when i was um eight or something like that my grandma dude she had this weird little laptop looking thing that wasn't quite a laptop but it had lots of little games on it so i played like snake so much it was great I don't think I completely beat Snake. I don't know if you guys have seen like a completely beaten Snake before, but that takes skill. And uh, as y'all can probably surmise, in that department, I am uh, working on it. <laughs> working on it. But yeah, we need we need a uh, well there. All orbs, growing container, aesthetic, maybe have riverbeds on the side, why not? Maybe a nice little fireplace, get some crackling sound, maybe some rain sounds, provided hot chocolate. Warm room, free heating, if it's winter, free, free cooling if it's summer. That's the kind of thing that I, that I want to bring to the world as Pachu v Britannia. Wasn't... Wasn't Lelouch from Japan? I'm forgetting where the Britannia came from. Is that just like New World or something? I need to rewatch Code Geass. I always thought that Snake was one of those endless games like Flappy Bird. It is not. Very interesting you bring this up. Very, very interesting. But yeah, apparently what you do is... Like, let's imagine that this was the block here where your snake game was pretty much bounded by. You just have to collect all the orbs and then shoot yourself into, like, a nice little, like, concentric or consquared bit of squares. This is, this is a weird sentence. And then you win. And then, like, the ceiling falls and you get, like, confetti and maybe a cake or something. I'm not sure. Britannia is just Britain but fancy. Yo. I should have a code Gios, like, watch party. Possible Steph, welcome, welcome. Hopefully I pronounce your name right. I hope your new year is going super well and thanks for stopping by the stream. We're just taking all the L's in Slither right now. And talking about code Gios, hiss hiss. Yo. I found out the other day my homie was a snake. But he's an anaconda, so that's kind of cool. You did? I haven't joined for a while, but this is to talk you, not Sam. Welcome, welcome. Welcome today, welcome forever. I hope you have been really well. I do remember to talk you, not Sam. We vibed. I hope all of y'all's years are starting off really well just have like a cozy check hopefully hopefully y'all are really cozy because y'all deserve it okay Twenty twenty two can be your year my day started with glass breaking wait back up not into the glass again but but what happened that sounds terrible Let's see, my year started off with, uh, coming back to my apartment. That was cool, I guess. How did the glass break? What kind of glass was it? My cat kicked something off my window and it broke. Bro broke. <laughs> broke. I can't speak today. Uh, I need to do my tongue twisters. She sells seashells by the seashore. He sells seashells by the seashore. Got it. Was it something precious to you? That's really messed up that your cat did that. I'll give your cat a, a firm talking to and a bonk. Don't you worry. This, I'm the 
the punishment police. I feel like my confidence in saying that was very Hufflepuff. <laughs> Snakes don't die, they respawn. Why is that true? And not really? Okay, it's good it wasn't too precious then. Hopefully it didn't make too much of a mess and you bonked your cat a couple times. Man. Man, oh man. Other than that, I hope your year is super nice and it, you know, gets better from... Having glass fall. Isn't it that if you like cut a snake in half, then it just like grows another snake head? Would you guys want that? Like, what if that were true of people? You could just be like insta friend. Well, that sounds like a sounds like a service, like a Facebook or an Instagram. Never mind that. But like, what if you, like, you know, very safely cut yourself in half to have a second head and then, like, you have, you know, someone to talk to all the time. Maybe that would be awful. Cut a snake, two snakes. Hey, you say cut a snake, two snakes. I say cut a snake, two friends. You, There are two friends. I can try, Steph. Please don't do that. I'm just saying, what if, and would that be cool? We are talking in hypotheticals. Please don't try this at home, kids. Also, you didn't hear it from me. Thanks would infinitely multiply then? Oh, I just thought of a pile of snakes and how hard that'd be for my brain to render. Oh man. I'd probably, like, give up after the, I don't know, the fourth snake. Y'all know I can only count up to four. Four is a big number. Yikes. Oh, do y'all think you could stand in a room full of snakes? For... Name your price? I feel like I could do it. I saw a YouTube video where if you just become one with whatever is around you- Oh my gosh, it's a heart. Love y'all, hope y'all are having wonderful days. If you become like, one with whatever your surroundings are, then you won't feel like worry or pain or anything like that. Kind of like if you're standing in fire like the this is fine dog, then like you won't experience- Oh goodness. <sighs> Goodness, and you want to experience like pain from burns or if you're like I am one with the with the water then you won't drown again don't try this at home just a YouTube video I saw I'm not a doctor uh I feel like I could stand in a room of like a lot of snakes for lower than you'd expect as long as they're nice snakes. I feel like to be in a room with starved snakes, it would probably cost a lot more- Eh! Oh! It got me! I was just trying to leave. I thought he was like AFK. Here we go again. Back on the saddle. Here. Uh, all I know is if you don't move around in the room, then the snakes won't bite you, but they slowly either choke you or start consuming you. Um... Well, it won't be for very long. Like, overnight is a no-no. Overnight will cost extra. Honestly. But for like a solid, like, time span, less than how long it would take for the biggest one to you out i feel like i could do it and it honestly wouldn't be that bad i feel like my heart could take it i don't know about y'all though what if we did it as a team effort i'll stand farthest from the door because i suggested it A 
let ye who be most squeamish stand near the opening of the door as respectable too. Posture, please. Oh man, oh man. I've been hunched over like a gremlin for hours. Thank you, thank you. My spine is now aligned. All is right. Actually, if I adjust, like, my mic arm, that'll make my back straight, too. You have some great ideas, Bunny. Keep them up. That was a great idea. Correct your posture. I'm sending you to posture jail. You can try. Can't catch me. I'm too fast. No, can't catch me. My posture is rapidly changing. My spine is a snake. This is just my spine the whole time. Going back and forth. Back and forth. I think my grandma's spine might be like that. The other day, she told me it was like that, and she's like, you think I should get surgery? Yikes. Imagine if you had, like, a snake-like spine. I could do whatever it wanted. That'd be tough. It all comes back to snakes. No reality. Only snake. Give in to snake. That's all there is. I wish I had some nice snake facts for you guys. Hmm. Actually, I can do that. Let me look up some snake facts. I feel like that's what that's what we're missing right now, snake facts. You guys ever like You guys ever like waited at a bus stop or something and you're like, "You know what I'm missing? Snake facts." All right, let's do it. Let's do it. This is straight from National Geographic. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm -mm -mm. The red spotted viper is a venomous snake found primarily in Asia. Unlucky. Very unlucky. Oh my gosh, I have to have a subscription to National Geographic. I guess that's the end of snake facts. They always do this to me. I really thought I could get those snake facts for free. I'm. Frankly. I'm disappointed. And my day is ruined. No, no, no. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. I almost forgot the whole meme. There must be other snake facts out there, though. Okay. Mm -mm. Mm hmm. This will be the time. There are 3,686 species of snakes. Is that wild? You guys ever held a snake before? R.I.P. Snake Facts? Oh, you're sleeping on Snake Facts? Never mind then. Just kidding, Bunny. Just for that, you get another Snake Fact. Some snakes eat birds. I kind of expected that one, though. I mean, we eat birds. We're apex predators. We play apex. I expect snakes play apex too. I need to try apex. I never got around to doing that. I feel like it'd be really fun. I had to lay off of like intensive games like Val and Apex until I figured out how to get like a two PC setup. But it's here now. So, I will try it. I was also thinking about learning how to play League, but it looks very complicated. Complicated. Some snakes eat bunnies? Alright, that's enough snake facts. I see this is a... This is a not good area. I am so sorry that you had to go through that. The snake facts end now. Just kidding. So, snakes 
evolved 142 million years ago. That's the last. That's the really the last one, though. That's that's the only one after the time that I said there weren't going to be any more. That's the really the last one. Never again. I think Neanderthals were like 40 years ago. Just kidding. Just kidding. Imagine. I mean, my parents are over 40. Imagine if like your parents were Neanderthals and you just like evolved. That'd be crazy. But also kind of cool. I don't know how Thanksgiving would be though, or like other family sit-down meals and family gatherings. Probably be kind of awkward. Dad, put down your bludgeon. You're making the homo sapiens nervous. Neanderthal society. I know that's not exactly how like human evolution worked, but I'm also not willing to go into detail. It's crazy to think we used to be cavemen. Exactly, exactly. And that computers used to be the size of a whole room. Now they fit in your pocket. You know how hard it was to like have a pop-up ad about your extended warranty when the computers were the size of a room? Hats off to those guys back then. They were true innovators. Imagine a pop-up on a computer the size of a room. Like, there's no screen to begin with. But, something really crazy, and this is kind of like... Well, it reminds me of Vocaloid because it's like synthesizer stuff or like tones were generated by a computer like in the 60s or 40s or something like that like a really long time ago like coming up on like 80 70 years ago and it's kind of like vocaloid level stuff all you could hear were just generated tones like that we are calling you about your extended warranty and you have to like find a way in these really old languages that take forever to run stop like whatever ad was playing just kidding that's definitely not a scenario that happened but if it were imagine pop-ups on old ibm computers must have been a nightmare viruses on old ibm computers must have been a nightmare I mean, I used to think that a virus was just a tiny dude crouched in my computer. That scared me a lot when I was smaller. Beep, beep, beep. Boop. Exactly. But imagine your computer is the size of a room. It's basically just a giant just crouched over you. Very, very scary stuff. I bet he'd want to take down your wall too. Giants have a thing for walls. Maybe Titans do. I need to catch up with the with Attack on Titan. I guess part two of the fourth season will be out soon. I feel like I, I caught up. I caught up to the first part. I think. But I should check. Man, oh man. Then this year we have some really nice releases. Cannot wait for a few of them. Like being Puppycat, dude, is coming to Netflix this this year. 
I need to have a watch party of Bean Puppy Cat along with Code Geass. I love Bean Puppy Cat. If you haven't seen Bean Puppy Cat, now is your time. Aren't there certain viruses that help computers? Oh, 100%, 100%. Undo percento. Let's see. What is some poodle virus? I feel like, uh, I'm just typing in what is computer virus. I feel like that's a bad. Yeah, it's like a, it's a bad thing, but like, I feel like the, the programs, the good ones that can like take over and help stuff. Those are the good ones. As I said, good 300 times. A piece of code which is capable of copying itself and typically has a detrimental effect, such as corrupting the system or destroying data. But then, if you wanted to say like a good program, you could say a piece of code which is capable of copying itself and has a beneficial effect, like improving the system and maintaining data. I guess that'd just be a, a good program. Wait. If you take the opposite of that, doesn't that just describe like Windows? Hats off to all of our good programs out there. I would like to say that I am many, many days without a virus. Okay, you know the things that stop viruses are firewalls? Yes. But those are beneficial programs. I feel like the base of viruses and firewalls, like being able to take over your computer when stuff isn't going well. I feel like the heart of it is that. But viruses are the bad ones. But still, imagine you have a computer the size of a room. You get a virus. You give up. Because those rooms are like millions and millions of dollars, I bet. Ugh, that'd be terrible. You just have to burn the room down. Or dust off all of the components somehow. Can you get rid of a virus through hardware? I actually have no idea. I'll look that up. Get rid of virus hardware what if you just have to like like just like when like the SNES like when those cartridges didn't work or when the CDs didn't work what if you just have to like blow them off reinsert them maybe that's how it works with hard drives when you have a virus I'm not gonna try that I'm also not gonna get a virus to begin with um... Oh! Wait... A virus damaging hardware is a very widely believed myth, but it's not impossible. Wow, there's really no hope. You have to burn down your whole computer room. Imagine if you had to flamethrower the entire room. Yeah. It looks like it can, like, hurt everything. Man. Couldn't be me. Because I use NordVPN, just kidding. I feel like that ad is everywhere. Everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. I don't use NordVPN. But uh, I feel like everything, <laughs> everything makes me feel like I should. Hashtag ad, lol. <laughs> I promise you, like the amount of times I've heard about NordVPN. I couldn't tell you another company if I tried. And I can try really hard. That's like one of my best qualities. 
Just rampant as raid shadow legend sponsors. How many of those people actually play raid shadow legends? I feel like you see some of those people and it's like last online six years ago. No viruses for anyone. <gasps> and printers get viruses? I must know this. I feel like um, PlayStations and Xboxes and all of that can probably give... Oh, printers can get malware and of course they can get hacked. Okay. Oh no. Now I'm sad. I know smoothies can't get viruses though. Because we're liquids and computer bits hate liquids. That's my one saving grace. Aside from being 12 feet tall and fighting bears on the weekend. Aside from that, being a liquid has many advantages this dream isn't sponsored by raid shadow legends the hit mobile game with over 80 different legends to choose from and hey guys if you want to team up with me you just have to find ratman 47 that's me ratman 47 i'm online sometimes use code bunny at checkout in order to get a lot of free dlcs and skins I think that's how that works. I don't trust these small snakes anymore. You mess around with them. Man. They sink their fangs into you and that's it. You're too fast for me. I really don't like things that move super fast. Bing. Thing should just be nice and slow. There's lots of time to reflect if we are slow. I'd much rather be slow than fast. Also why my nickname in school was Snail, but I wore that with pride. Which reminds me, uh, I had like a friend that was really tall. Then one day, like they're really slow too, like a slow giant. One day they ran full speed and it was very scary because they can move quite quickly. That was a, that was a very surprising day. And I was like, never do that again. There's supposed to be a, a tree, a tree that moves slowly. Keep that vibe. Trees don't sprout legs overnight and you're not going to start. Well, it's about that time. About that time, gamers. I will offer myself to someone and then... We will see about someone to read. I have to study for my exam tomorrow. Sad gamer energy, but I'm also working on some art, so that's fun. Hey. I hope they enjoy that. Let's see who is out there. Out there in the big unknown. Hmm. I'm never there when I'm supposed to be. Pain. Pain and suffering. Okay, last time it was really hard to get back. Here. Oh, I'm silly. Literally, I was looking stuff up on my phone. I can totally look up someone to read also on my phone, but instead I was looking for... I don't even know. A typewriter? I was looking for an abacus. I have no idea. Oh! 
All right, this person right here we're about to raid, I love very much. I sure hope that you love them as much as I do. This person here is Ama. And I hope y'all show her a ton, a ton of love. I will catch y'all on the flip side. And have a wonderful rest of your year and new year. Thank for stream, thank for visiting. I'm sure you're busy with all of your your own streams, Hifu, and usually I do shoutouts a little faster than this, so I feel bad about that. Yes, go follow Hifumi as well. LOL, I use Discord notation. Why am I such a dweeb? Until next time.